What's up, fam? This your boy Rebuke, and I got some breaking news, man. Nine victims reported killed at a uh, Allen, Texas mall, I believe it was, in uh, northern Texas. Let's get the details. Listen to this. Roll that clip. We are covering breaking news out of Allen, Texas. A shooting at an outlet mall shortly outside, small distance outside of Dallas, Texas. At this point, law enforcement says the shooter is dead. They believe he was acting alone. They also say that nine victims have been transported to local medical facilities. We've learned that the youngest victim at this point is just five years old. At this point, there is no information on the total number of fatalities or a possible motive. I want to bring in now Camila Bernal, who I understand, Camila, you have some new video. Yeah, we just got new video into CNN. This is a man who was at the mall at the time of the shooting. He was in the parking lot and he was able to record a, a part of the time where these shots are heard and people are seen running out of the mall. There's, of course, a lot of commotion. And at the beginning of the video, you hear five shots and then you start hearing more gunfire. Now, I do want to warn you that this video is disturbing. Here it is. Trapped by unreliable internet? Break free and retake control. So as you can see, man, that was actually the actual gunshots that was going on from the uh, the shooter. Now, the man who took that video says he did not see the shooter, but said, of course, he tried to get out. He said he is extremely sad for the people who lost their lives here. Um, I also want to point out that officials in Allen, Texas, say that it was an officer who was there on an unrelated call who was able to kill the shooter. He then called for backup and uh, our sources here at CNN telling us that the shooter was wearing tactical gear. It took some time for authorities to figure this all out. They were looking for a possible second suspect. Eventually they came out and said that it was just one shooter and he was uh, dead. Again, we're waiting for that information from the Allen Police Department, which should come in about 30 minutes. But we have made calls to a number of local hospitals and there is one hospital group that confirmed that they had eight people that they were treating as a result of this shooting, the youngest being five years old, and them ranging from five to uh, 61 years old. So we're waiting to hear about the victims because, of course, that has been the focus of today. The people who have been impacted by this, whether or not there are fatalities, the people that have been injured, and, of course, all of the witnesses that had to experience this because we've heard from so many throughout the day who either had to hide who had to get help from people at the stores, had to go to a back room, or just simply people who had to run, who were afraid. And unfortunately, people who saw the shooter and who saw victims and are describing what they saw, it's of course something that no one should have to see. Paula.